it's been drilled into all of our heads since literally childhood that drinking during pregnancy is bad. But this week, lots of news outlets have been running stories which suggest that some drinking while pregnant might actually be okay. Facebook's trending news algorithm identified a New York Post story that claims that light drinking during pregnancy does not harm the baby. The opening statement of the story further elaborates by saying pregnant women who drink up to two standard glasses of wine a week are unlikely to harm their unborn baby, a new study suggested. Coming to this conclusion that drinking during pregnancy may not actually compromise the health of a pregnant woman's unborn child is like finding an inconclusive study on how licking dog butts affects our health, then writing a story that says it's safe for humans to lick dog butts daily. As Donald Rumsfeld once said, absence of evidence is not evidence of absence. Are doctors really telling us to unlearn the one piece of medical advice that's been pretty much universally accepted without argument? Let's take a look at the actual science. A new study in BMJ Open analyzed the existing evidence of the effects of light to moderate drinking during pregnancy and how it influences the health of the resulting child. As it turns out, the results of the study were a little ambiguous, and it found out that there was insufficient data to meta-analyze or make robust conclusions. Despite the lack of data, the BMJ Open still saw some evidence that even light prenatal alcohol consumption is associated with being small for gestational age and preterm delivery. So what does this mean for you? Well, mostly it means that we don't know whether light drinking during pregnancy is harmful, but scientists don't know does not make a good news headline. But there's clearly a need for more research on what happens when pregnant mothers drink even a little bit of alcohol. The authors of the BMJ Open study suggest that doctors could theoretically recommend that pregnant patients abstain from light drinking, if only as a precaution, because better safe than sorry. But if doctors do this, they must also make sure to inform patients that there just isn't enough evidence to make any definitive statements on the effects of light alcohol consumption during pregnancy. Now clearly this study is more for medical professionals than it is for you. If you're pregnant and want to drink a little bit, just know that scientists aren't quite sure if it will negatively impact your child's health. But know that the precautionary principle would suggest that you probably should just abstain.